D. Look, your guys' coronation is on the front page of the online edition of Hot Paws magazine. What? Again? <laughs> Guess you guys are still big shots around here. Especially since we live in LA. What's the article about this time? Uh, just another story about you and Drake. I still can't believe they managed to find out about your last date. But our last date was prom. Now they know which school we go to? No, they left that part out. I just hope that nobody at our school tells anybody not from our school. <laughs> yeah, that would be something if everybody knew. Aww, you and Drake are so cute together. I ship it. Dorrance for life. But we are dating. <laughs> Who says you can't ship a couple even when they're already dating? <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going? Just the bathroom. I'll be right back. Wait! What is it, Florence? Is everything okay? Um, yeah. Why wouldn't I be? It seems like every time me and Drake are brought up, you decide to leave the group. Are you jealous of me and Drake or something? Uh, what? No. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's a nice guy, but I don't even like him like you do, Florence. Then what's the matter? It's just... It's just... You and Jules and Alice. You called? Oh, no. <gasps> are you guys having a slumber party? Oh, uh, yeah, we are. You can join if you want. Oh, really? Thanks. Oh, I was interrupting something, wasn't I? <laughs> I'll go now. Anyways, three of you... You just look so happy with your boyfriends, and I guess I just feel a little left out sometimes. I know Shelby doesn't have a boyfriend either, anymore, but she'll probably give you tips and advice on his likes and dislikes and- <sighs> Okay, I'm getting ahead of myself. Fern, I had no idea. Is this why you've been having nightmares? I- I don't know for sure. But other than prom, senior finals, and graduation, I feel like that's one of the only logical answers. Oh, Fern, why didn't you just say so? I just didn't want to interfere or make you feel bad. Hey, you're my sister. I'm not going to take it personally. But don't worry. We're going to go into your dream tonight and we'll help you every step of the way, okay? Okay, cool. Aren't you coming? Uh, you know, I wasn't lying when I left that group. I really need to use the restroom. Oh, <laughs> uh, sorry. Go ahead. I'll see you in a little bit, though. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, Florence. Best sister I could ever ask for. Okay, truth or dare? Dare. I dare you to jump off the bed and have Fern catch you with her magic. Whoa, that sounds awesome. Can you do it, Fern? Uh, we'll see. What? <laughs> Kidding. I've done it before. Oh. Whew, you scared me there for a second. <laughs> okay. One. Two, three. Oh, wow, you did it. <laughs> Another magic job well done. Ow. Oh, uh, sorry, loss of concentration. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm not letting bruises get me down from having a good time. 
All right, it's your turn with Fern. Okay, okay. Truth or dare? Uh, truth. Who at the moment do you have a crush on? Ooh. Well, honestly, I don't have one. Oh, come on, don't hold back. This is your chance. Um, guys, maybe you no, should. No, really. The only person I can think of right now is your brother. Austin? <laughs> <laughs> but he's already married, so I don't stand a chance. Now do I, Jules? And expecting. What? <laughs> all right, all right. Cats out of the bag, I guess. I'm going to be an aunt. Oh, wow, Jules, I'm so happy for you. That's awesome. Is it a boy or a girl? They don't know yet. They want it to be a surprise for when it's actually born. When is it coming? Um, I'd say a few months from now. Probably after we graduate. Oh, I wish we could see your brother and his expectant wife. Don't worry, you will. Because they're coming here to visit and I'm inviting you to the shower. <laughs> this is so amazing. I can't wait. Yay! Girls, what is all the ruckus about? Oh, uh, can I or do you? <laughs> I don't care. Go ahead. Her brother's wife is going to be expecting in a few months. Jules is going to become an aunt. Oh, wow, Jules. Congratulations. Are you excited? Am I? I couldn't be happier for Austin. All right. Well, I came up here to tell you that it's Fern's bedtime and she's on a sleep schedule. So you might want to call it a night. <sighs> Mom, we're 18 years old. We don't have bedtimes. But we'll call it whatever we want. <laughs> good. Well, good night, girls. Good night, Mom. Good night, Mom. Good night, Your Highness. Good night, Your Highness. Good night, Aunt Rachel. Come on. Let's go brush your teeth and then get to bed. I think I'll sleep in my own room tonight. Oh, that's fine. You're right next door. Are you sure you'll be all right staying up? If you're not really up for it, you can go to sleep if you need to. <sighs> Are you kidding me, Fern? No way. I'm staying up for one night for you to sleep countless nights. Aw, thanks, Florence. You're so sweet. <sighs> you know, this could actually be the best night's sleep I'll ever have. Florence, Shelby, what are you doing up so late? Sorry, it's just, I, I just thought that I could join you in the dream world. You? But you don't have any, you don't, um. <sighs> yeah, I know, I don't possess magic, but maybe if I hold on to your paws, you perform your spell. <sighs> it's worth a try. Now, 
hold on to my paw and- Is there room for one more? You too, Jules? Well, alright. But this spell is new to me, so it may be hard to perform on more than one person. So brace yourselves. This is going to hurt me more than it's gonna hurt you. What? It's painful? Oh, no, Wu, but you know what I mean. No, you guys might want to keep it down because Fern might- oh, what? <gasps> Hurry, hurry! Okay, okay, grab my paw. Are you okay? You kind of blacked out there. Ugh, oh, never better. I think. Oh. Did it work? Well, we're in surrounding darkness, just like the way Fern described it. Wait, how did you even do that without your necklace? I thought all your magic came from your necklaces and your sister, and. You weren't wearing your necklace when you performed the spell. Maybe some of the spells in the spellbook don't really require our necklaces. Now, I don't know what part of the dream world we're in, so we may have to split up to find Fern. <gasps> Girls! Fern! Oh, thank dog! There you are! Wait a second, how did you guys all get here? You don't have magic. <gasps> um, I think we have more problems to worry about. <gasps> the shadow! Okay, we need to split up. If any of us see anything suspicious, then we gotta gather up. Got it, ditto. I'll go with you, Fern. Shelby, Jules, you two pair up. We'll see you in a little bit. See you in a little bit. So, my dreams are consistent because they're trying to warn me about something? That's what the spell book said. Part of the page was torn, so I don't know what. But it's something bad that's gonna happen in the future. Oh, okay. So, this is what your dreams are like? <sighs> yep. Same old, same old. Except last night when that <sighs> figure showed up. Right there! Hiding. He knows you're here and it won't come out. Hey, it's okay. I won't hurt you. I just wanted to thank you for being here. You're welcome. No way, don't go! Please come back! Oh no. This is the part where the shadow attacks. Quick, grab my tail! gone? <sighs> Looks like it. I guess we still have some power when we're together. That must be Jules! Come on, I think it came from over there! <gasps> Jules! Jules? Are, are you alright? Oh, please be alright! <gasps> oh no! Where'd she go? Please, come back! Oh no. I knew I shouldn't have turned my back for two seconds. That shadow was fast. Fern. <gasps> Jules, is that you? But uh, you're, you're. Fern. Jules, I. Oh, Shelby, not you too. <gasps> Oh. 
Oh. <laughs> it's only you. Wait, what are you even still doing here? I thought you came here to protect me, and now all my friends are gone! <laughs> now I'm in a living nightmare that I can't wake up from! I'm sorry. You're sorry? You're sorry? Just leave! Get out of here! I ever do to deserve? Uh, wait a second. This is. <gasps> <gasps>